My name is Dan Garcia. I was born in Caracas, Venezuela. I uh, came to the U.S. when I was 17 years, uh, so I've been in the country for 26 years. I work for C.W. Matthews Construction Company. I'm the president of the company. So obviously it was a very challenging project. Uh, on March 30th, uh, the impact to Atlanta was, uh, was, as you know, substantial. We were called in to do a very difficult job. Uh, everything went really well. The Hispanic force was uh, essential to be able to complete the project. Approximately 80% of the workers that, that worked on that specific project uh, were Hispanic. Obviously, they did an amazing job. We're, we're so proud. Without them, the work wouldn't have been completed in the short period of time than it did to, to do a project like that and complete it uh, in 43 days. It's just amazing and astonishing. My name is Alonzo Rodriguez, and my position is a carpenter. And I'm from Mexico, and I've, I came here about 16 years ago. As soon as we got there, you know, it was, it was a mess, a little mess, like, you know, everything was burned down, people were demolishing it. We got there about probably like three days after the accident that happened. My job was to, you know, you know, start getting everything together. We have to be at the job site around 7, well, at 7 on point. We start working from 7 on to 11.30, that's when we take our break. And then we continue working till about 4.30, 5, around there until like the job is done for the day. My name is Jesus Alvarado and I represent C.W. Matthews and my position is foreman. My biggest challenge has been the I-85 project because there was no mistakes. We had, we had to make sure everything was done on time, was done perfect because there was different things that needed to be put in place at a specific time from concrete, rebar, you know, they, everything was on a very tight schedule. 